Hi, welcome to Taste Test Game. Today we're taste testing different mac and cheeses. Uh, we're gonna start with Kraft Macaroni and Cheese Deluxe. Hmm. Good. Hmm. Good cheesy flavor. Could use some more cheese though. Overall, pretty good. Taste is a slight bit of like, I don't know, just tastes a slight weird, but it's mostly really good. I'll give it a, uh, I'll give it a eight. Next we got Kroger Deluxe Mac and Cheese. Oh my goodness. The texture's really weird. Also, it doesn't really taste that great. Nah, doesn't really taste that good even now. <laughs> but it's not like terrible. It's not bad, but it's not good. Texture's also really weird too. I'll give that a I'll give that a five out of ten. Next we got Wisconsin Five Cheese Blend. Hmm. Has a really good texture, but the flavors, the flavor isn't bad nor good. The flavor's just weird. The flavor isn't bad, but the flavor isn't like really good. It's just like weird. I'll give that a six and a half out of ten. Cause the texture's good. All right. Now for our final mac and cheese. It's the our Cracker Barrel. Mm. It's really good, um, really good taste. Good texture too. I think I'll give this, hmm. Hold on. I think I'll give this uh, eight and a half. I'll give it a nine, actually. It's really good. Really good flavor, really good texture. Yeah, just good. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't know what went wrong with this one, just like the texture was nah, and so was the flavor. This one had a really good texture, but the flavor I wasn't as good. I think they put more work into the texture. But it wasn't necessarily bad. It's weird. Kraft Mac and Cheese and on the, uh, what's this one called again? Cracker Barrel? Yeah, Cracker Barrel. And we're very close, but Cracker Barrel just has a little bit better texture. But both really good flavor. But anyways, yeah, that's potato escape. Bye.